Lisa here from the Stop, Drop, In It podcast. Today I am bringing you another Paradise Fibers unboxing. The June bag came today and it says Beach Vibes. So let's dig in. I'm actually extremely eager to dig into this month's Paradise Fibers bag because unlike usual, I have actually just completed a spinning project and I have a drop spindle free and ready for some fiber. So let's open this one up and see what we've got. All right, and pull out the cards first. This one says, title, title. Okay, Paradise Fibers June 2022 Fiber Club newsletter featuring our new dyed bamboo top interesting i have never spun bamboo all right in your bag dyed bamboo and a treasure bag all right majestic and mighty our newest shades of dyed bamboo top offer a serene palette inspired by the vast and ethereal tides of the seven seas available in a range of solid and multi-colors in your bag approximately two ounces of water horse solid silver slash blue two ounces of sea spray solid light blue and four ounces of glimmer glass multi blue slash purple all right so let's check out the fiber there's this little bag here okay so this must be the sea spray solid light blue i would think sea spray maybe let's see what else that one yeah yeah all right and then this one so we've got all of our bags so this one is the water horse, which is solid silver splash blue. Okay, so let's hold these up for comparison. I see what they did. They put it in like a silvery bag and they put this one in a blue bag. So these are those two colors. Look how shiny those are. Those are those two colors side by side. And then the multi blue slash purple is in this bag. So each of those are two ounces. And then this one, oh, this is pretty. This looks like a mermaid. It looks like an just iridescent. It just looks iridescent. Look at that. All right. That's gorgeous. It is so, so super shiny. Okay, so all three of these together look like that so pretty so this is is this really solid bamboo let's see um yeah it's just all bamboo okay and then there is a treasure bag in here so let's open the treasure bag all right well that's pretty cute um, it's a cute little bag. Okay, so there is some eucalyptus, which is good because I just ran out of mine, in eucalyptus and also lavender. So that's always really good to have on hand. And then there are, oh, that's cute. There are a couple little stitch markers. So this one here. This looks like a like a seashell and then this one is a seashell it's kind of hard to see that one I think so they're two little little seashell stitch markers and as always we have our stash tea this flavor is coconut mango and she got a little bent up but this is the Eunice sticker of this month Okay, so inside the treasure bag, 
In your sea anemone-esque bag, you'll find the following treasures. Two travel size eucalyn fiber washes, two shell stitch marker progress keepers, one vinyl sheep sticker, tubular, and one coconut mango stash tea. Okay, so let's check out what they recommend. All right, so bam, beautiful. Okay, bamboo tops are making a comeback with 16 new mystical solid shades and six multicolor shades plus an undyed option. There are 23 different bamboo shades total. Three of them are in your bag now, but the rest are being reserved for Fiber Club members only via special order. The fibers will be available on our website for all at the end of the month. Reminder, you have a uh, okay, so there is a special code that you can use for your 10% discount if you are a Fiber Club subscriber. Okay, bamboo fiber provides natural sheen and softness that feels and drapes like silk, but is more affordable and more durable. A bamboo garment is soft to the touch due to the round and smooth structure of its fibers. All bamboo plants produce an agent called bamboo kun, which helps bamboo resist odors by acting as an antimicrobial and antifungal agent. Bamboo clothing is hygienic and fresher smelling with this agent as odor producing bacteria cannot grow in bamboo cloth. That's interesting to know. Moreover, the fibers are highly absorbent and they wick away moisture from the body three to four times faster than cotton. When it is hot, humid, and sweaty outside, Bamboo clothing keeps you drier, cooler, and more comfortable. Compared to cotton, hemp, wool, or synthetic fiber fabrics, bamboo fabrics are more breathable and thermal regulating because of their unique structure. In addition to its resistance to excessive wrinkling, bamboo can also tolerate warmer temperatures when being washed and dried without shrinking. With this silk substitute, you can design beautiful cooling garments for summer. And then they show here, um, okay, these are the different colors that they have to offer. So I will just put those up there. They are called Glimmer Glass, which is the one that came in our bag. And then this next one is Crater Lake, Katagat, Kattegat Bay, Coral Sea, Nile River, and Blackwater. And then all of these over here are the solid color options over there. So the project that they recommend is this beach bag, the Wave Market bag. And so that is a design by Ashley Connick. Konechny, Konechny, sorry, I don't know how to pronounce your name, but it is a, actually a crocheted project. So I do not know how to crochet, so I will find something different to do, but the pattern is available for free on Ravelry.com. Again, it is the Wave Market bag, and it looks like that. So for our crocheters out there, that might be of interest to you. So yeah, so they, um, they give you suggestions. It says bamboo fiber makes for a fantastic garment to keep cool in the summer heat, but it also makes for a strong and fashionable carry all tote for beach outings, grocery shopping, and outdoor excursions. Regenerated cellulose fibers such as this bamboo can be trickier for some to spin as the fibers are silky and slippery. Spinning the fibers from the fold with low tension and a high amount of twist can make spinning go smoother for those that are having trouble. There is a bit of a learning curve with spinning plant fibers, but with practice and patience, you will be pleased with the unique yarn the fibers produce. So I will be very eager to spin up some bamboo. So let's just have a look at the three colors again. It does look just like a mermaid tail. So, oh, and that goes flying. 
So these are the three colors together, glimmer glass, and I don't remember the other two, but a silvery blue and then a light blue. So definitely this one I might be spinning first. So it just looks exactly like a mermaid tail. Okay, this is probably the shiniest fiber I have ever gotten. So let me know what you think. Um, I'm wondering if I should attempt to spin this on my drop spindle or if this might be a better spin on my eel wheel nano, which is currently packed away in my new place. Um, but let me know what you think. Have you spun bamboo? Do you have experience spinning bamboo? What do you think of it? Do you enjoy spinning it? Would you do it on a drop spindle or the eel wheel nano? Let me know. And I will see you guys again next month when next week's bag, when next week's bag, when the next month's fiber bag comes in. Thank you for joining me today and I will see you again soon. Mm -hmm.